rich folks love more than going downtown and slumming it with the poor. They pull up in their carriages and gawk at the students in the common just to watch them talk. Take Philip Schuyler, the man is loaded. Uh-oh, but little does he know that his daughters, Peggy, Angelica, Eliza, sneak into the city just to watch all the guys. It work, work. Angelica, work, work. Daddy said to be home by sundown. Daddy doesn't need to know. Daddy said not to go downtown. Like I said, you're free to go. But look around, look around. The revolution's happening in New York. New York. York. Work. It's bad enough Daddy wants to go to war. People shouting in the square. It's bad enough there'll be violence on our shore. No ideas in the air. I'm looking for a mind to work. I'm looking for a mind to work. I'm looking for a mind to work. Like somewhere in the city Someone in a rush next to someone looking pretty Excuse me miss, I know it's not funny But your perfume smells like your daddy's got money While you slumming in the city in your fancy heels You searching for an urchin who can give you ideals Sir, you disgust me Ah, so you disgust me I'm a trust fund, baby, you can trust me I've been reading Common Sense by Thomas Paine So men say that I'm intense or I'm insane You want a revolution, I want a revelation So listen to my declaration We hold these truths to be self-evident all men are created equal And when I meet Thomas Jefferson uh. I'ma compel him to include women in the sequel Work! Look around, look around At how lucky we are to be alive right now Look around, look around At how lucky we are to be alive right now History is happening in Manhattan And we just happen to be in the greatest city in the world In the greatest city in the world Not a price that you're willing to pay You cry in your tea But you hurl in the sea When you see me go by Why so sad? Remember we made an arrangement When you went away Now you're making me mad Remember despite our estrangement I'm your man You'll be back, soon you'll see you remember you belong to me You'll be back, time will tell you remember that I served you well Oceans rise, empires fall We have seen each other through it all And when push comes to shove I will send a fully armed battalion to remind you of my love. Da 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 You say our love is draining and you can't go on. Subject, my sweet submissive subject, my loyal royal subject. 
project forever and ever and ever and ever and ever you'll be back like before I will fight the fight and win the war for your love for your praise and I'll love you till my dying days when you're gone I'll go mad so don't throw away this thing we heard cause when push comes to shove I will kill your friends and family to remind you of my love da 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 I may not live to see our glory I may not live to see our glory But I've seen wonders great and small I've seen wonders great and small Cause if the town cat can get married If Alexander can get married There's hope for our ass after all With a glass to freedom hey! Something you will never see again No matter what she tells you Let's have another round tonight There's a class to the four of us oh. and To the newly not poor of us now We'll tell the story of tonight Let's have another round Well, if it isn't Aaron Burr Sir I didn't think that you would make it To be sure uh, I came to say congratulations Spit a verse, Burr I see the whole gang is here You are the worst, Burr <laughs> Ignore them. Congrats to you, Lieutenant Colonel. I wish I had your command instead of Man in George's journal. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Now be sensible. From what I hear, you've made yourself indispensable. Well, well, I heard you got a special someone on the side, bird. Is that so? What are you trying to hide, bird? I should go. No, these guys should go. What? No. Leave us alone. Man! It's all right, bird. I wish you'd brought this girl with you tonight, bird. You're very kind, but I'm afraid it's unlawful, sir. What do you mean? She's married. I see. She's married to a British officer. Oh, shit.